so that when I turn this camera, this camera on an angle, you'll get the uh, true effect. This is something we kind of we got to do. We kind of work at them backwards. Is that we, uh, we learn to operate the scanner by looking at the screen. We have a customer that uses this. He has to put on a hazmat suit and climbs into nuclear reactors to scan stuff. Really? Yeah. And he has to, he ha can't move the laptop around, so he has an extension. He has a 35 foot firewire cable on it. And he wears some uh, open glasses on it with a little screen in front of him. So he can... Okay. It's pretty, just a little USB screen. And it works adaptive. So this time, the um, <coughs> image we see really is the Virgin Mary. Yes, it is. Yeah, see? Unlike the piece of toast. Yes. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Yes, that's right. It is. So if your hand is a little shaky, does it account for that? So it's that taking... You can that? see... Um, Not that your hand is shaky, but... It's no, no. <laughs> Actually, we have a cut. We, we have a gentleman who uses an 800 to do uh, inspection work, and he does have uh, uh, he does have a tremor, but he rigged up a... Uh, it's pretty interesting, using... I think a shower curtain rod and a towing hitch ball. He has a counterweight. He's got some sort of ring to keep it steady for him. But that's if you're doing. I mean, if you are, if you are uh, moving around either too quickly or um, too um, your hands shaky, you will get a little bit of noise on the surface. Um, but what we find most time, folks who are using the 800 that are doing the really fine high resolution stuff with really fine details. They'll mount they'll put it they'll mount it on a stand. We have one um so you can see so it come out pretty good. We actually have a uh, 